Why does a bee die instantly after stinging a human, while other insects don't? The answer to this question reveals one of the greatest wonders hidden inside the bee's body. You see a tiny creature that looks weak and harmless, yet it's a queen when danger appears. When threatened, she unleashes her final weapon, the sting. And that's where the amazement begins. To really understand why the bee dies after stinging you, you first need to know how its stinger is built. The bee stinger isn't like any other. It's a needle covered in tiny barbs that curve backward, like small hooks. The tip of the stinger is lined with fine, backward-pointing teeth. This perfect design works flawlessly when the bee fights other insects. The stinger can go in and out easily. But with humans, it's different. Our skin is thick, and it grips the stinger like rough plastic. When a bee stings us, the stinger gets stuck like a tiny anchor buried deep in the skin. When the bee tries to fly away to escape, she can't pull it out. And as she struggles violently to free herself, the worst happens. It's not just the stinger that stays behind. She rips out part of her own digestive system. A piece of her body tears away, remaining embedded in our skin. This deadly rupture kills her within minutes. That is how nature prevents your blood from mixing with the honey inside her stomach and contaminating it. If the fluids in your body mixed with the honey inside her stomach, that honey would become spoiled. So if the bee survived after stinging you, the honey inside her would no longer be pure. That's the true miracle. But there's one more surprise. Even after the bee dies, the stinger left in your skin keeps working. The venom gland still attached to it keeps pumping for more than a minute pushing poison into your body. The venom contains melatonin, a very powerful protein that causes pain and swelling. It also sends out invisible chemical signals alerting nearby bees to attack the same target. So the sting isn't a personal attack, the bee knows she'll die. But she chooses to sacrifice herself to protect her queen, her sisters, and the honey project they've built with tireless effort. Like a soldier who throws himself into battle to defend his homeland, the bee performs the final act of her life and she does it willingly. True wisdom is in that sacrifice. One bee can protect an entire colony. The other wonder is balance. If the stinger had no barbs, humans would keep underestimating bees and destroy their hives easily. The price of defense is her life. The sting is used only in extreme moments as the very last option. The same bee that gives you drops of golden honey on your table is also the one ready to die to protect her home and her sisters inside the hive.